Well, hello, and a chilly, chilly good evening from us. Just want to offer some sort of a warm welcome on this coldest of evenings to those of you settling down in front of the fire. For the benefit of those who weren't aware, there was a pitch inspection here a couple of hours ago, as a result of which, gladly, it was deemed safe for the game to kick off as scheduled. The ground staff have done a really terrific job in clearing all of that snow, and their efforts, I am delighted to report, have indeed paid off. And we have in front of us this gloriously imposing arena, absolutely picture-perfect for a game of this nature. been given a lineup which suggests a 3-6-1 formation. Jim. Well, I'd be surprised if this were to remain as defensive as it's it's shaping up to be, Peter. You know, even 3-5-2 and the second striker sounds much better in approach. So if this genuinely becomes an exercise in in getting behind the ball, we're in for something rather un unambitious and unadventurous. And I hope that's not the case. Way. Jim, who do you reckon is pivotal? Tricky, but Karen Benzema. What impresses me about the Frenchman is his willingness to, to keep good shoots. He's done very well to get to that. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Good save. He got a decent fist on that. Benzema. Modric looking to penetrate opposition lines. Marco Asensio. He's had a shot! Inui. He is fouled. Sydney. Dinks one in. Well read, he sorted that out. Marco Asensio. And they've got it back as soon as they gave it away. Good starting the game at a pretty decent tempo. Kings it out wide. Aimed in towards the centre. Modric plays it forward. Bill! Oh, the keeper's done ever so well. The keeper really dug out his defence then. A magnificent effort. Bale. Played, he saw that coming. A real chance to break. That's good paid to a promising move. And it's been taken straight back. Up to meet it! Oh, great save, real class. Well, as Tesco Peter, the keeper has just received an A plus grade. Asensio with the slide tackle there. Canales. On the other side yet able to force a breakthrough here. That's an untidy challenge. Free kick given. Modric. William Carvalho. Canales. 
And it's Inui. Hit long and direct. Good challenge, he just stood firm. Canales plays it short. Massive leap! Goal! Real Betis! And it's Real Betis who take the lead. Great header, made it look easy. Oh, look, it's, it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header, and if you get it slightly wrong, then you'll struggle, but that was beautifully met, it really was. Real Betis take the lead. Yeah, and they know there's plenty of work left in this one, Peter, before they can actually say that the job is over. Inui. And it's got through. Well, that's where he wants it. Javi Garcia positions himself well and cuts it out. Inui. Well, it really is one cross after another. Oh, with a target to hit, why not keep up the supply? It's simple and, and efficient because they all know what they're doing. Inui plays it out to the wing. Loose ball, who's going to get that? Played out to the right. Bale. Going through. Modric. He's good for it. He scored. On the cusp of half-time, he delivers with perfect timing. Swift, incisive, deadly, all done in a matter of seconds. Yes, the turn and finish is to be admired, but what about the sense of urgency and desire to move the ball with such pace on the break as soon as it was retrieved? certainly made things interesting. Oh, I think the coach will really be annoyed with that. The players were still thinking about their goal and just got caught napping. Marcelo gets it back. Benzema pushes to get on the end of it. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. He's got a whack. Benzema! They've scored! Oh, my goodness, that has ripped the rigging. That is just the top drawer finish. He was always in control and couldn't have placed it any better. Real Madrid go. And the first 45 minutes are up. Real Madrid come roaring back in quite some... And gets things going for the second half. No, that's not the ball he wanted. Bale tried to play it through. Bale clearly is miffed having made the run and not get picked out. Garcia. Bartra. Well weighted. Moran with a fine tackle. Good run, ultimately thwarted by an astute piece of defending. Crowd appreciates good football all round there. Casemiro. Here it comes, Lucas Vasquez, he's left his man. Cleared without complication. Bartra, very firm in standing his ground there, it is a tough... That's a foul, no two ways about it. Well, the referee has made it pretty clear now that this is his last chance. Yeah, and he's just entered the last chance saloon, one wrong move now and he's in trouble.
attempts to play it through. Back into the middle. Tries to get it forward quickly. But this is exactly the approach they have to take now, Peter. This isn't the time to talk about risks now, Jim, is it? They just have to hurl everything at it and hope for a break. Well, there's no two ways about it. This is what they have to do. Inouye. Sidney. Good spell of possession, this, but very little to show for it. And we're not going to make any further progress now. Shots! Oh, and they really should have been made to pay. Towering header! He has done it! A two-goal lead, and they're firmly in control. Great corner, and he did the rest. Well, as contact goes, that was tremendous, and it helped him to direct it exactly where he wanted into that net. I think when it comes to the aerial department, this fella is definitely no sledge. Well, that has changed the dynamic somewhat. Listen, it's up to them now how they think about it from here, because for me, it's crying out for them to force the issue. It upfield. That's sprayed out wide. Comes in hard, but he's taken enough of the ball. I have to say, that was an exemplary tackle. Stopped him dead in his tracks. He's made sure that that won't get through. Managed to get it away. Teo. Keeper's given it away. Aimed long and direct. And it's Lucas Vasquez. Christian Teo. Inui. William Carvalho. Tries to stroke it through. Christian Teo. He's been taken down and the referee has pointed at the spot. And that really is the last thing they wanted to do. Well, the players are making their point, but the ref clearly isn't interested. He's waved them all away. <laughs> oh, brilliant stop from Courtois! Goal at his mercy, and somehow he's missed it. Well, they're definitely going about things the right way, Peter. A goal soon can, can bolster energy levels now. Lucas Vasquez was steaming forward. Oh, he's going to be pulled back for that one. And that has been clubbed away. Played back in. Oh, flags up. He must have been offside. He may have been caught offside, but, well, Peter, from experience, defenders, I can tell you, hate those runs in behind. Tavi Garcia. Sydney. Has it out wide now. Crosses in a lot. Shoots! Good stop. That wasn't easy. Christian Teo is very sporting here to acknowledge the quality of the save. A lovely little footballing moment. Cross goes looking. Out to the left it goes. Javi Garcia cuts it out. He's got through. Big chance here. 
He's gone down, but the referee just tells him to get back up again. William Carvalho. Forward it goes. Oh, well intercepted, really alert to the danger. Going through. Oh, it's a mistimed tackle, and it is a penalty. Real Madrid present their opponents with the best possible chance here. Uh, look at the amusement and dismay from the culprit, but the referee clearly thinks there was enough there for a penalty. Yeah, well, they were exposed and, and vulnerable, and he knew he had to do something to prevent a goal then. Dispatched with certainty. And it only took a little drop of the shoulder to send the keeper completely the wrong way. Didn't he take it well? Real Bet. And that's that. Real Madrid winners after an absolute.